I've been feeding each of my hives slabs of fondant from time to time. This is a typical case. I'll remove the telescoping cover and set it down on the ground. This is my insulated inner cover. I got insulation on top and um, it's enclosed in a frame and underneath is a layer of homosote, which is moisture absorbing material. If I slowly pick this up, you'll see the bees underneath. Notice the homosote has a circular stain, which is to be expected. That's where the moisture, the metabolic moisture is absorbed by the moisture board, leaving very little moisture inside just enough for the bees to have enough to condense on the outside frames for licking as necessary but this is my clear plastic cover over the layers of fondant when that telescoping cover or that uh, insulated inner cover is removed the bees remain very calm it's almost like a a glass inner cover where you can look through and watch the bees work you can see the two new slabs I had to put on this morning because they were totally out of fondant. Last time I gave them fondant was a couple weeks ago. If I lift the corner of the plastic to say good morning to the ladies, good morning girls. They're very calm. You see the top bars, the entire surface of the top bars is covered with bees and they are, they are already attacking this or these new slabs of fondant. Will they fly up at me? Sure, probably. If I moved in a jerky fashion or was quick to rip off this plastic, it might scare them. But this is an easy way to inspect the colony during, during the winter with this plastic sheet over the over the fondant. I've done this at much colder temperatures. I don't keep it open any longer than I have to, but for purposes of this, of this video, I'm keeping it open a little longer than necessary, actually. So now I'm going to replace the insulated inner cover which takes the place, by the way, of an inner cover. My regular wooden inner covers with a hole in the middle, they're in the garage. This goes right on top of my feeding shim that has that wire basket floor to contain the feed. And then I replace the telescoping inner cover. Uh oh, I mean the telescoping outer cover. I usually don't make that much noise when I'm using two hands. And that's what I do for winter feed.